current pandemic crisis in the country is affecting most families across the country. With an unimaginable number of people affected, the health infrastructure faces a challenging task to manage the crisis. Shortage of medical oxygen, lack of ventilators, and many more health infrastructure deficiencies created panic among the patients. Many leading corporate houses came forward with a helping hand to the governments in handling the crisis. The global infrastructure major, Megha Engineering and Infrastructure Limited, MEIL, creating the health infrastructure, including supplying liquid medical oxygen. In several states and establishing the treatment facilities on a war footing, MEIL is importing cryogenic oxygen tankers from Thailand to mitigate the oxygen shortage crisis in the country. MEIL is producing oxygen in its manufacturing units. So far, MEIL has supplied at an average of 400 cylinders or 30 lakh liters per day to Telangana, Andhra Pradesh and Odisha. To meet the future demand for oxygen, the third wave becomes a reality. In any case, it began manufacturing the cryogenic oxygen tankers with the DRDO and the Ministry of Petroleum and Natural Collaboration. The top management believes that nothing is more important than human life. MEIL is creating medical infrastructure like oxygen bed facilities. It has already created a 500 bed oxygen facility in Madurai in just 72 hours and handed it over to the Tamil Nadu government. It has already began installing over 3,100 oxygen bed facilities across Tamil Nadu. It donated three ventilators to the NIMS Hyderabad. MEIL is only the organization in India to be forefront in providing enormous facilities to its employees round the clock at every level such as testing, doctor consultation, medication, quarantine, food, hospitalization, vaccination and medical oxygen cylinders to pandemic hit states. The company established a state-of-the-art oncology facility at NIMS Hyderabad. It is also supplying hygienic food for patients and their attendants in various hospitals under the Bhojanamruta scheme.